this is so of a shirt. I mean, we're just so alike. We have so much in common. I have something to, to <clears throat> tell you. And mm, I, I, I have been like completely straight with you about something, and that is um, because I'm I'm gay. Um, really sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you, you okay? No, it's okay. I just threw up. A <clears throat> oh, I'm so. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. I I, uh, I went to a bad place in my mind. So. Yeah. All right. I think we're ready. We're good. Okay. Okay. Here we go. It's very very reasonable. I found him on Craigslist. Okay. Cool. Oh, hi. How long have you two been together? We're not Three together. Weeks. At all. Okay, I mean, we're, we're not we know each, know each other for a certain time. We know each other, we're friends, we're, our mothers went to college together. And I feel like I've known her my whole life. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. 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 I should have judged. So, yeah. I should have. Yeah. Like, that's what I should have done. And I just don't understand what I'm doing. I should have just stuck to designing women's pocketbooks. But that's really what I should have done. It's really. Um, hi, I'm, I'm here. So, can we just take a deep breath? No, I mean, I just, I, I need a deep breath. Oh. I just think that was good for me. Okay, yeah. I just, yeah, yeah. Really good. I don't good. understand yeah. any Okay. Of you two, you've known each other for three weeks? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you're just friends? Yeah. I mean, technically. Mommy, yeah. 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 You're just friends. Yes. Like a soul friend. And Soulful yeah. friendship. Three weeks. Yeah. Yes. So why on earth are you in couples therapy? Well, I mean, you know, my mom always said that it was good to go to therapy. So and I it, thought... It's only been three weeks, but we've already been hurting each other. Yeah, and she hurt me. She hurt my feelings. I mean, you didn't need yeah. to, but like... Hey, look, you guys are onto something and it's really great. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna make it work. Uh -huh. It's gonna be fantastic. A lot of work to do. A lot of work to do. Sure. You have to go. I have, I have clients coming here. And oh, I'm gonna have to of walk course, about. you have other clients. Okay. For a session, right? For a session, but you, yeah, you're, great. So. you're yeah. great. You're great, both of you. Cool. I, I, I like your room, the space, the yeah. furniture. Yeah, it's, like it's minimal. Yeah. The view is amazing. Yeah, yes. Gorgeous. I mean, oh, yeah, this yeah. whole place is 6,300 square foot. Oh, it's wow. a commercial oh, wow. space. We've got a kitchen. We've got a bathroom down the hall. 14 rooms. Oh. It's a really great. The lighting is great. The location. Anyway, I have to go. Yeah, I have yeah. A client coming in. Oh, of yeah. course. And um, I might not be here. So uh, oh. on Monday, the place might get rented out. So yeah. worse, we'll just meet at Starbucks, and then we'll go from oh, there. Oh, I love it's lattes. Right. Let us know. Yes, right? definitely. Yeah, because okay. it's only a fifteen-minute session. Yes, so if yeah. You don't yeah. tell us, don't, and we guys, miss it. You guys are great. You're gonna be okay. 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 Thank you so much. Bye. Okay. Bye. I have other clients. I mean, a total of three. Well, these two plus my mother, don't judge me. I'm also a commercial real estate agent. I mean, a guy's gotta make a living. You know how expensive it is living in the city? This is my Uncle Shlomo's place, and I have to rent it out, so I'm really sorry. I'm gonna just get, can you just leave? Yes, yes. Uh-huh. Just come right up. I'm right up. Just come on right up. So are are you a top or a bottom? Right in the middle, like somewhere I... in between. I'm, I'm you know. Sorry. Who's that woman? Oh. Oh, that's Deborah. That's my good friend. Deborah. Great friend. Yeah. Hi. Oh, my God. Hi. Um, James. Yeah. Yeah. James from, yeah, from uh, UF. UF. The theater department. Wow. So we were in theater together. Yeah. Wow. And uh, oh, we, we dated. Yeah, yeah we did. Well, and we went, went on a date. date. Wow. So it's not really... Dating yes. if it's a one. <laughs> right. Your voice is higher. It is. Yeah. Yeah. I always <laughs> knew you would move to New York. So. Well, it was um, in the stars. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> is it written in the stars? Are we paying for some crime? Is that all we're ever good for? That's from Aida. Right. The musical. The Broadway show. Right. Yeah. Leanne Rhymes also. Recorded it with Sir Elton John. <laughs> I have to go because I have the runs. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. Okay. Okay, I'll see you. Okay, see you later. Um. Mm -hmm.
anyway, so that, you, I guess you know each other. You know, I think I'm just gonna follow her for a I moment. I think that's yeah. good. That's best. Am I like everybody's good luck, Chuck? No. For people who are gay? No, 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 no. You're just so sweet. You're gonna find someone who loves you. Size six? <laughs> You're a size six, right? Yeah, that's hilarious. You guess sizes? That's so funny. I asked specifically. I only do four to six. What do you mean I couldn't be the Messiah? Sorry? What did you say? Why couldn't I be the Messiah? Oh my god, he's not kidding. <laughs> my great aunt's name is Ruth. Hmm. I mean, I guess technically you could. I don't see world peace happening yet, but... Yet. No, no, I think that takes a little bit of time. <laughs> you have met your match. <laughs> Mary. <laughs> Mariah. <laughs> you know, something like that. Oh, okay. Hi. Hello. Boss. Did my Aunt Ruth tell your grandma that I am not Orthodox? You grew up modern? I'll refer you out. <laughs> Why do we need religion anyways? I mean... I'm sorry? I like to get to know women through their bodies. I know it sounds a little old-fashioned, but I'm like a hopeful romantic. There's so much more to intimacy than just, you know. I would really like to take the car out for a test drive before I leave the parking lot. I've been burned in different ways, and I'm hoping for a real commitment. I think you need more of a Ford, you know? And I am like a Subaru. Mm -hmm. Maybe. What if you need an oil change? This metaphor is not working. Yeah. There's too much salt on one side. Yeah. I'm a little OCD. Yeah. Yeah. We all have stuff. I'm sure, that's a dog hair. I have anxiety, so. I understand. So you are dealing with that. Oh yeah. Cool. I meditate every day. Pray. Color. Do crafts. Color. A journal. I have a lot of good friends. What about you? What's like some of your hobbies? Uh, collect guns. Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was so awful. I'm sorry. I mean, NRA? I know. And this is a typical week for you? Yes, and then at night I cry in my bed and I ask God, do I have to go through another one? Like, can you just send my soulmate? Yeah. It's exhausting. How have your dates been? They've been okay, but yeah? the, a lot of guys were like, they have this kind of attractive exterior, like this manly sure. facade. You get all the good ones. Well, I liked your profile. You seem like a fun guy. But Hi. then they start feeling comfortable with me and- Love housewives. You know, Todd, I really feel like I could be myself around you. And I'm like, no, shh. Don't talk. And that's who I signed up for. That guy <laughs> on the profile. Not the real you. Don't be yourself. Man. Man. Thank you so much for taking me here. Sure. This I mean, is, you had some bad enough days. This is almost romantic. Oh, it is. You know? It's beautiful. I kind of wish we could go somewhere. We, we can't pay for that, so. And what little mouse Johnny figured out was that you don't have to make it to the finish line. As long as you're trying and you're sticking it out, we all win. Because even if you don't get what you want, you know, you're, you're getting further than you thought you could. And I think that's so important to learn at an early age. And that is Almost There by me, Todd Schlag. Just because you don't have a kid by the age of 40 doesn't mean that your, your life isn't good enough and it doesn't matter. No, that's true. You know, if I don't meet a guy in the next six months, like, we should definitely consider having a family together. Really? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Six months. No, I'm just kidding. No, 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 I mean, really. no. Uh, really? Me? Uh, no. 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 Hilarious. I feel That's like hilarious. it's a good sign. It is a good sign. I like it. Yeah, it's kind of almost romantic. It's like it's not a snow. It's almost romantic. <laughs> you know, like if we were together, it would be romantic. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like little birds, like 
Okay. And my book will tell you all about how you can underachieve <laughs> and you can under earn and under be because it's hard out there, you know. So, the left. <laughs> but just make sure you have good life insurance. And cut. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs>